Our judges have completed their placings in the five-year-old class. Our production award winner is entry 3707, Rosaire's Blexi Goldwyn, exhibited by Woodman Z. Abbott Van Axel, Budjan and Vale of Lomira, Wisconsin. Placing third in the class is entry 3709, Brackley Farm Chelios Cheerio, exhibited by Milk Source of Kukana, Wisconsin. Second in the class is entry 3692, Weeks Dundee Annika, also exhibited by Milk Source of Kukana, Wisconsin. And the winning entry, Best Utter and First Bread and Own, is entry 3703, Weeksdale Judges Harmony, exhibited by Glamour View, Franken, Franken Day and Borba, and Weeks of Walkersville, Maryland. Congratulations. <laughs> Judge your comments. Well, I tell you what, if you're sleeping in the stands, you better wake up, because this is quite a class of cows. Give them a big round of applause again, please. The cow at the top of the class, she's our kind. Hard top, balance, dairy, has power, strength, mass, and balance. She comes to the top of the class quite easily for us. She's a cow that she's a little flatter, a little neater the way she carries her tail, a little neater in her pin setting. She's a cow that shows a little more veination quality all the way through her udder. And she's also a cow that's a little deeper all the way through her forerib down into that chest floor to carry her over the cow in second. Second over third it is on the, uh, the udder. I prefer the levelness of this cow's udder, the way it blends a little smoother in between the quarters, all the way through, and the tightness and neatness, squareness, symmetry to the top of the rear udder to go over the nice frame cow here in third. Third over fourth uh, cow for us when she's on the mover in line. She's much stronger across her top through that loin region, and she's a cow maybe that blends a little nicer in between those quarters and has a little more desirable size and shape to the teat than the ultra-powerful pow cow there in fourth. Fourth over fifth, when you see the cows in line viewed from the front, this fourth cow just outpowers the fifth cow. Much stronger muzzled, stronger chest to take her over the silky cow here in fifth. Fifth over six, it is on her dairy quality. She's much more uh, angular, a little more silky about the hide, and much cleaner through the bone in her leg than the white cow here in six. Six over seventh on the udder. When you get behind them, the six cow is more square in her rear udder, shows more definition as you see him, and shows more length and quality all the way through her fore udder. Congratulations again, ladies and gentlemen. Please give them one more round of applause. It was a fabulous class. <laughs>